party people, David here, and welcome to Love Yourself Friday! I'm so excited for today's opening because I just got this figure and I have to open it now. I'm gonna be very excited to have this playset and this figure because like, there are so many Zelfs, I wanna get them all, and plenty to talk about in Zelf world, but let's take a look at the, oh, it's Toadstool, Twirl, and Swing. And this comes with the exclusive Ribbita figure. Um, it is a swing for three selves. And I think it, they do pop out, but everything is kind of tied in here. So we'll get it open and we'll see what it's like. Just so you guys know, I went on YouTube and I watched every single Zelfs comic. I'm not a Zelfs comic fan. But I am a Zelfs fan. I think the Zelfs are totally cute. I think that it's a, it's a world that I'm very interested in and I really would love to have all of them. However, there seems to be a superficiality maybe to the comics. Go ahead, watch them and post in the comments below what you think. The process of making this video, I broke the handle on a pair of scissors. <laughs> Don't use small scissors for tough things, apparently. So we have the swing set out and it does, they do pull out. So you are, um, <clears throat> it gives you instructions. Instructions are simple. That's the instructions. You cut and remove all three cable ties. If you, if your child get an adult to help you, kick up your leg, yourself's leg, yourself's. <laughs> That's very cute. And press yourself firmly into the seat. So we will use Vampula here, kick up her legs. And, um, well, they already have these cute things in it. I'll take a look and I will show you guys in the next video because I don't want to take any more time opening this thing right now. But it does spin and they do kick out and that is so cute. The way this thing is, I'm definitely gonna, would suggest locking it down on the table because I'm sure you could overspin it for sure. But that is so cool. But if this were a real swing, you would get really sick. Really sick. But it reminds me of those swingers from like the fair that go out like that. That is really, really cute. And here's Ribita. Ribita is very, very darling, very cute. And Ribita has, instead of ears, little bumps up here, which remind me of like frog, toad warts. Um, she has on her arms, little webbing which is kind of like um door fins they're fins she has fins on her arms she has fins on her legs she has a cool gradient thing here where it goes from like a dark green to a light green nothing on the front but on her sides she it's little frog speckles on the head as well she has frog speckles her eyes, I believe, are green, but they look more totally black, which is actually really, really cool. And then on her upper back, she has a heart freckle there. And then on her butt is her toad symbol and her Z. Oh, she's adorable. I'm so happy to have her. I know that Chad just got her um, in a, a fan mail, but I'm just happy that I bought her. Ribita also comes with her own charm, which is a frog. And it actually, on the back, is the back of a frog. So it's actually really cool. It kind of looks more like a toad, but it could be also a frog, like animated feature frogs. That is her charm. And she did not come with a brush. Yes, yes, yes on the Ribita. I love this playset. I love her. She's totally cute. I'm so excited to play with her. Our blind bag today is going to be Moshi Monsters. I got this at Justice for, um, I don't know, like two bucks after the 40% plus 20%. So my camera apparently has issues and didn't like that I was recording. So I've already started opening this Moshi Monsters bag. They do not have tear tabs. Boo, boo, boo. Right here's a full list. And inside you get a card that kind of gives you an example of everything, plus your Mo Moshi Monsters mystery code that's on the back for the Moshi Monsters website. The cool thing about these is you get two in the pack, and I paid about $2, so that's not bad at all. So our first one is... Fizzy! Oh, that is really cute. Fizzy is super cute. 
Very cute. Got the tongue sticking out. Oh, that's adorable. That's adorable. And our second one is Boomer. So Boomer looks like a porcupine Nerf ball. One of those balls you put in the dryer. Um, and he has either headbands on or rubber bands on his head. Adorable. These are adorable. I think I might try to get some more of these because these are really, really cute. I really, really like these. So today was a good day. Yes, yes, yes on the Ribbits itself. Right now, she is at Toys R Us for $9.99. That comes with the swing set. That's not a bad deal, given that even the older elves are still going for $6 each. So really, for... $4 more, I got a cool playset for myself, or even other toys. You could strap them in with rubber bands, you know, just to play with it. And it looks really cute. And I'm going to have a whole Zelf set up somewhere in the office. I know I am. Also, yes, 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 on the Moshi Monsters packaging. I like these. These are so cute. Uh, I'm excited to see some other ones, so I'm going to try to get to Justice and maybe get some more of those, or maybe from somewhere else. I hate going into Justice because I always end up returning because everything there is like three times the price, but then they go, oh, it's 40% off, so you think you're getting a good deal, and then you realize you're not really getting a good deal. You could have got it in cheaper somewhere else. So I'm still working on that, uh, but I may get some more of these because I really do like them, but it won't be for a while. Like I said, we're on spending hiatus for a little bit of time. I'm not sure how long that's going to last. I will save up and try to get a Zelf, one Zelf a month. That's my plan, but I might go stop by some Goodwills every so often and do like maybe Goodwill shopping videos. I do like going to Goodwill. I went there the other day and got $10 worth of stuff, which was a ton of stuff, which was more than way less than I'd spent somewhere else. And I got a lot of things that were in bags, old McDonald's toys. So actually some of those are going to be in our blind bags because they don't have any information on them. So I'm so excited for some extra blind bags that I got. So yes, those are great. All right, everybody, share, like, favorite, subscribe. Tell me in the comments below what you like. Tell me in the comments below what you hate. And I'm so excited to be doing these videos. I will see you next Monday for Monster High slash Mattel Monday. I think I'm going to be doing a new Scare Mester doll. I'm not sure. I have a lot of dolls to do. Some of them are older, some of them not. But I also have, can do some in-the-box reviews of the ones that I get from Ever After High. But it is Mattel, so I wonder what I have. I have to take a look around and maybe we'll do something really, really cool. I do know that those new Minecraft blind boxes are made by Mattel. So that could be included on Mondays. I might get some more of those because at Walmart they're only $3 as you saw in my shopping video. So anyway guys, I'm David. Thank you party people for watching and I will see you on Monday. Enjoy your weekend. Bye.